Hey cuties, Peachy here. Welcome back to a new video and it's been a while since the last Barbie news video but we are back and we have so much Barbie news to talk about so let's get into First it. First up here thanks to Apapusi de Domele for these pictures of the new Barbie um, holiday uh, 2022 but this one's obviously the redhead uh, doll from this lineup because obviously there's always like m different versions and this one's the redhead one which is everyone's favorite for a good reason and she's the prettiest one by far. She has the Odile fa face sculpt, I believe. Uh, she is looking to the side. She is so pretty. Um, I would definitely get her if I could. She's a Walmart exclusive, y'all. So get her while she can. I believe I heard she sold out even. So be on the lookout. Definitely, she is the prettiest one out of this lineup for sure. I mean, look at her face and look at that red hair. Just a beautiful um, doll. And she makes the dress look 10 times Next better. Next up, thanks to at Plastic Tan here for these pictures of these new Barbie Santa dolls that are going to retail uh, $19.99 and coming out between September and October. Um, now, this one right here, the brunette one, I don't know what her face sculpt is, but she is also looking to the side and she looks so cute. And then we obviously have the normal Barbie blonde one and she's also cute. I do love the little Santa hats. They're fluffy and the dress is very simple and they both come with accessories like a little teddy bear, cookies, uh, a present um but um yeah it's they're very simple dolls but the brunette one definitely is my favorite she's just she looks so sal salty and sassy with those side eyes you know giving me the stink eye i don't know she's just so pretty and i just next love up her. we have more pictures of the new barbie color reveal um neon pets here there's gonna be five uh, as always and the, they're just in different colors and they have little little skates um, and disco balls as a little uh, containers it's really cute but they're just they're just pieces of plastic I just didn't really appeal to me but here we also have the um, Chelsea's and a little uh, boy uh, for the Chelsea lineup obviously and they're cute they don't have the rooted hair they have that thing where it's like only like a ponytail um, they all come with roller skates so and that's really cute obviously um, they do have some color change features you know like a little bit of the hair turns uh, changes color but they all just come with like one um, fabric piece which is the bottom piece next up thanks up Pussy de Mele here once again we have a first look here at the Barbie styling heads these three come with a the added on hands so you can paint the nails and in these they are just the heads they don't have the added on hands or anything so that's cool I don't know the price point or what else they come with but you know it's good I, I had a Barbie styling head and it was fun I don't know what happened to her I probably cut her hair off but that <laughs> thanks to add a plastic tan once again we have a better looks here at the next wave of Barbie extra dolls going from number 16 to number 18 First up here, we have um, number 17 or 16. Um, she is the one with the purple hair, the crimped purple hair. She has a bunch of layers, the sunglasses, the you know green jersey dress, and then like the oversized checkered uh, uh, jacket. I just, I really like her. I feel like she's very vibrant. You know, the purple and green do just provide that really nice mix of um you know colors and then here is her dog her purse and then uh this just the accessories so yeah i mean i don't care for the dog like you know but they come with it so um so yeah she's uh no she's uh, she's number 18 okay so she's number 18 and um yeah this is her in the box next up we have number 16 uh she has like really platinum blonde hair with uh blue streaks in them and then she has this two-piece kind of jacket with matching skirt um the jacket even has uh some buttons glued on to kind of simulate buttons same goes with the skirt has some buttons glued on her little uh, uh, sweater underneath is um, just plain white, but it's so cute. She has a lot of gold um, accessories, ju gold jewelry. I like the um, paisley print they gave the you know the two piece, a jacket and a skirt. Um, her shoes are very cute and simple. And then here's her dog, her purse, her sunglasses, and here she is with her in in her box. Um, so I definitely feel like if I would be ranking these, she would be my second 
highest. And then the last one will be my lowest. And then lastly, of course, we have the best one, in my opinion, my highest ranked, number 17. She has the pink shirt on with the two-piece uh, matching set as well of the jacket and the pants. Um, they both have like the cheetah pattern and then the, the jacket is actually fluffy. It's like, it's like a real coat. And then the pants have the added on strip down the sides in pink. I just think she's such a pretty doll. Um, not the outfit alone, but also the hair. The hair is super long. It's in a really deep kind of cherry red. And I just, I feel like she's now, so pretty. here are her accessories, her sunglasses, her little uh, pink headband. And she comes with a coffee cup, um, her dog, and her purse is a slice of cake. I mean, I don't know what is up with that. I don't know what is the what is the deal with the weird thing theming of the purses sometimes. As, as same goes with like the Raquel Barbie extra doll. She also had a purse. It's like a piece of pizza slice. So sometimes these purses are weird, but uh, I, I don't care. She's cute. I, I don't care. <laughs> and then here she is in her box. And um again, I don't know. She's just so pretty. And I cannot wait to get her as well as the um Barbie um with the Moschino kind of looking uh, print for the skirt and top. I cannot wait I have to more get more information this on the new Barbie Extra 5 pack with this exclusive uh, Barbie on the bottom right with the overall baby baby blue iced theme. Um, they're available, it's already available on Amazon UK for 148 and Amazon Germany for 166. So yeah, they will be um, uh, available on uh, other Amazon websites shortly. I'm I'm you know i'm pretty sure um but this doll is exclusive to this five pack she is not sold separately. we have full looks here at the new barbie style fashion studio with doll so this is gonna be this is already out you can already order this on the mattel creations uh site and it retails at 150 bucks and that's not all because if you are not a, a member a barbie member to on the website so that costs nine for like a whole year if you are not already you have to purchase that additionally and that costs 160 basically um and then shipping and all that that's not included so it's a lot of money it's almost 200 bucks just for this set a uh, vanity set with a doll two fashions a lot of accessories a lot of like uh jewelry and stuff so that i mean that is really nice but like is this worth so much money um i mean the the lights do work i don't know if i already said that they work but they do work they light up in real life um the dress is really nice you know it's it's cute it's a cute mermaid dress but i don't feel like it's very detailed um and then we do also have some real life pictures here um thanks to at ray the doll stylist on instagram they already ordered a few and so they do come with a purse you know and it's not even a dress the mermaid dress is like a separate top and the skirt is a separate piece um it does come with like a little jewelry holder like watch holder watch uh, a second outfit like, um, boots shoes it's a lot of stuff like i mean you're getting a lot of stuff here and the vanity is good material and, the sh and the, even a chair it's like fabric you can tell like it, you can't even maybe collapse it so it's a really nice set but it's 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 expensive so you know oh yeah and the barbie is made to move so that's really awesome considering you know a lot of people are gonna buy this uh, who are adult collectors so i'm glad that she's at least next up we have this new barbie two fairy doll probably exclusive to walmart retailing at 55 bucks now she does have the five basic points of articulation so actually no she also has a wrist articulation but she's not made to move her dress is very pretty it's purple has a lot of ruffles and polka dots um and silver and then she has a crown a tiara on and silver her hair is white um and her face looks really pretty uh, she also has a pair of wings i don't know if they're fabric or if they're plastic probably plastic um they're probably removable or they are attached to the dress in some way she does also come with this cute little silver plastic wand uh you know that has a star and her shoes are super detailed they have this ongoing theme of like butterfly wings on the back and you can see that they're really nice uh she does have a heeled foot but these shoes don't have a heel so she is kind of like weirdly levitating <laughs> um she also has this included uh little bag here in silver with some coins some fake coins but that's a cute little touch um so yeah 
here's some more information and uh she's she's gonna come out soon i'm guessing but yeah i mean she's 55 a little expensive you know if she was made to move i would think okay fine 55 i'll i'll let it pass you know because made to move bodies cost more but she's 55 she's normal articulation and she has like her dress is pretty, but I don't think it's like over the top. So like, I'm not sure how I feel about the price point. <laughs> now we have this new uh, Barbie signature Polynesian set with the, I, I'm assuming it's a set that comes with all these dolls, uh, Karen, Rafa, and Leslie. I'm not sure if this is like a 10th anniversary for a show and they're, these are like characters from the show i don't know what this is like i don't i have i'm not familiar with it so like i have no clue what i'm looking at but um these are the barbie signature dolls um they don't have uh, a lot of articulation just the five points and i mean they all come off like the same kind of like shirt with the print um it's really cute i mean but i'm just not sure what like what part of like what is <laughs> like is this a show is this like i'm not i'm just i'm completely lost here so we have another barbie signature doll here barbie after five silk stone reproduction doll so she's already come out so they're doing a reproduction and i believe there's this is not the first one she's like the second one or so because they've done other silks and reproduction dolls in the past um and she's super pretty she's i have some silk silk stone dolls in my collection and they're like the most high quality dolls i've ever bought i believe um she has red hair a cute hat some pearl earrings the face up's obviously always pretty um her dress is black but has the white like um top um and then she has a lot of pretty details um yeah she's gonna release on july 28th so she's already on the website uh, available on mattelcreationswebsite.com you know on the website not exactly how i just said it um and then she she's gonna retail at 75 i believe and i'm not sure if she's a members exclusive or not next up we have a better look here at the new barbie cutie reveal series 3 uh which is winter themed they are releasing on july 30th which already passed so i'm assuming they're popping up in stores right now and they are also available on amazon so yeah these uh we've already talked about them in previous videos um but they are really cute um they just come with the same stuff all over overall you know it's just this is this is a winter themed line i'm not sure why they couldn't just you know say that on the packaging but um here's a better look at the um deer or fawn or you know character um i love her skirt and i love her boots out of all of these characters uh dolls she's the only person the only doll to come with a pair of boots that has some painted details which you know is like the white fur all of the other dolls they don't come they come with boots but they don't have any kind of painted on details so that's a shame but um they're all really cute like you know i feel like the owl and the deer probably are my favorites i would love to get the deer or again fawn i'm not sure if it's like a like what, what animal it really is but um yeah they all look really cute and i definitely get want to get speaking the of i saved the last the best for last once again here because we have our first look at barbie cutie reveal series four and this line is tropical themed thanks to add papusi da melee and a plastic tan for these pictures um so here we have some close-up a close-up of the elephant character and then here we have a close-up of the tiger character and it seems as though some of these animals um the color color themes are mixed they're not just like one theme but we'll talk about that in a second so here we have barbie um with the, a monkey theme and then lastly here we have a toucan theme for this doll and she's so pretty oh i love toucans they're just so pretty such pretty birds um so here you can see all four in one shot and as i mentioned uh with, like with the elephant it's not just all gray the suit she has one leg that's like blue and then for the tiger one leg is pink and then for hot pink and then for barbie the you know og barbie she, the blonde one she has a monkey theme but one leg is uh, like a light pink so the only character here who doesn't have like a mixture of colors is a toucan one because you know she has like the overall stripes on the legs but she doesn't have like one side one solid color and the other one like one solid color as well like so that's weird that they gave the elephant the tiger and a monkey characters um you know different you know color they gave him color blocking basically 
<laughs> like the tiger could have just been solid orange with the stripes. I don't need hot pink on one leg. I feel like that makes it look weird. Like they could have just made, like I don't know why they had to do that. Like they could have just made the suit one color and that's it. I don't know why they had to give it like a pop of color. Like, no, it worked. Like, I'm okay. But like, yeah, that was the video. I hope y'all enjoyed. Be sure to give me a big thumbs up if you did. Leave any thoughts or questions you may have down below. Let me know what you thought of this huge lineup of Barbie news. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you haven't already so you don't miss out when I post more Barbie doll news, doll reviews, a bunch more content coming your way daily and keeping you up to date with all the doll tea you love. Love. Stay safe, be kind. I hope this next time. Stay peachy. Kisses.